Alex Jackson. And I'm Jay Cutler. Here at Golden's Gym Las Vegas. For the 2008 Mr. Olympia. They haven't hit me yet, still. Jay says it'll take four months. <laughs> Three or four months before I can see him. I was ready for him to say Jay, because he said, <laughs> because he said, the next person that I call will be Mr. Olympia. I was ready for me to call Jay, and that's why I was extending the whole nonchalant. I knew Dexter won. I knew he was going to win. He was better on Friday. I came back on Saturday. It was a little sharper, but the, uh, the damage was done. Um, I think I was reasonably better than last year. Obviously, if I would have brought the combination of both the condition and the, the strength of the mass, I think that I could have had a real shot to win. I don't know. I kind of like had mixed emotions until um, we actually I started seeing the guys backstage. The guys would start pumping up and all that stuff. And, but um, at first, just getting there, you know, everybody's playing mind games and all that stuff. You know, it's typically about to the show. You know, but after that, nerves calm. I was pretty much ready to get over with. My experience at the 2008 Miss Olympia was probably pretty much as always. I was very confident going through the show. I like to keep things, you know, pretty hype, you know, always laughing and cracking jokes and stuff. But um, you have some serious, some guys will take it too far. Yeah, I get a lot of support. I'm pretty friendly with a lot of the guys. I mean, obviously I'm closer to some of the guys than others. And you're a little more ease going into competition. You know, positive attitude, of course. You know, I had a good time. After the Arnold, me and my trainer put together a game plan. And that was to add maybe another power to the muscle. You know, two pounds on me is a lot. So the goal was to get two pounds heavier than I was at the Arnold this year when I won the title. Got right back into the gym two weeks later. And, um, you know, we came out with a new product, the antibody halo. And, you know, I, I put on more size than, than I was bigger than I ever was. Hydroxy cut, everybody knowing those are my main products that I love to take, I was going nitro take and uh, mesotech. take. But when I started taking antibiotic halo on CC, that is what really gave me a push to put on a couple more, a few more pounds to, you know, to, to come in that short video I ever had. Off season I use a lot more supplements than I do pre-contest because of my travel schedule. I use a lot of protein powders and a lot of lucid. Mesotech was one of the companies that really has what they say is in the back of And uh, you know, it really made me feel good. Seems like every product that they come out with has the research behind it uh, to do everything it says it does. Being a champion bodybuilder, you want to take in the best quality everything, the best quality food, supplements, and the best facilities. You want to have everything in line perfectly to be able to be at your absolute best. You know, just let me win this title once and they can have it back. I'm already thinking like, man, I want to win it. I want to win this show next year because you know, one time just, just doesn't do it. Yeah, I think this year, um, you know, whereas, you know, years past, a lot of, you know, hype was built around Dexter and myself, and um, it should have been that way because we did hold the two biggest titles in the sport. And obviously, right now, the only thing that really counts is who holds the biggest title, and that's him this year. Obviously, next year, he has, he's the guy that everyone's after, and, and uh, you know, we look forward to just going at it again. It, it's going to be a battle. I mean, I'm sure, you know, Dexter, you know, he's, he's focused and he's going to be more driven now with the title. It definitely gives you an edge. You don't want to lose that title. It's an embarrassment to lose that title. Yeah, I, I feel that I still can win the title. The right J. Cutler for Zeke wins the title back. The biggest change with being Mr. Olympia is definitely the workload that comes and the opportunity. This is just an honor to, to, to be friends with Jay, to be able to call him and talk to him to help me with, you know, lead, being the leader of the sport, you know. Um, I'm going to be a great ambassador of the sport. Um, I'm sure Jay will be vintage Jay Cutler next year. He'll be back. There's no doubt about that. I would talk to the trash that I was going to win. He thought the trash he was going to win. He got me. And, uh, it's all good. It's all, it's all in good fun. I mean, we're both Fortunately, under the same supplement company, and we spend a lot of time together. We travel a lot together, and now we're the two leaders in our business. 
I'll put the sugar in his drink. <laughs> Double dose next year. <laughs> Yeah. We'll take it out, one or the other, because it either worked or it didn't, so. <laughs> I think it worked. Yeah, I think it worked, too. That was, I need to start doing that. That, that was pretty good. We'll get it on next year, big boy. <laughs> we appreciate the support. Bodybuilding is a unique thing. It's a lot of individual what we do, but we both have teams behind us that give us that extra edge. And, of course, great sponsors. And, and the most important thing is the fans that that keep us hungry and, and keep us motivated and of course keep cheering for us that's probably the most important thing.